I came up with this idea about two years ago when I went to Hawaii. A buddy of mine, Jonah Morgan, came in from Pipeline and showed me a photo that Mark Healy took of him from behind with a GoPro. And uh, I saw that and that just blew my mind. And I just had to figure out how to do it with a D3 in my hand, a camera which is quite heavy compared to a GoPro. So basically I'm getting a, I'm getting a jet ski assistant and uh, getting whipped into the wave. So I guess there's a lot of things that can go wrong, but I guess the worst thing is after the wave, you know, like Derek Donor told me once, it's, it's the ride after the ride. It's like you get pounded and then you go in for a ride and I'm holding this housing, you know, like this, protecting the port, kind of like a rugby and just going over and over and I don't have my fins to swim with, so I'm just waiting to come up and then after a while it lets go and then obviously I have a flotation device and, and a helmet. That actually gets gnarly because once it gets ripped out of your hands, then the housing just flying around everywhere. So that's like, you don't want it coming out of your hands. Well, Bruce was here for just a few days and he was actually meant to leave the day before. And I told him, man, we just try, try and, you know, change your ticket. And I think we we're gonna have a go at it in the morning. And so he did that and I, we were actually kind of bummed the next day because the swell dropped a lot. And he we kind of stayed, you know, optimistic. He's like, oh, let's go try anyways. And then and, and we went and then and we, first couple waves were just, one wave just hit me across the chest and then a couple ones we just couldn't, it wasn't a big day. So it was kind of hard to fit both of us in. And then that one came along and it was just, and just flying in there and I just came up screaming and like I said to him you know when that happens that means we got the shot you know it's just like you get this vision in there and there's no water drops and then you know you have the shot. Places I'd like to take this uh, would be uh, for now beach breaks you know it's quite safer than reef you know probably gonna try some Mexico stuff and there's a couple places on the charts and then you know, obviously it's gonna go to Chopa one day or somewhere gnarly or I'll just wear no leash and let go of it and, you know, whatever happens, you know, even if it breaks and goes to the bottom, you can just swim down and grab it and pull out the, the card and, you know, the photos will be on it. So, I mean, if we're really pushing the limits, that's how it's going to happen there with no leash and, you know, just dive, just, just. <laughs>